So what SmartThings Edge does is it took the device events and the automation events and was able to start processing them locally. So now when you use that motion sensor to turn on a light, motion is detected, that goes to the hub. The automation is processed on the hub and sent back over to the light to turn on without ever having to reach out to the cloud to confirm that event. Hey, I'm Tony Moreland, host of POW, the Samsung Developers Podcast. Be sure to check out my SDC 21 episode, where I sit down with several Samsung insiders to recap the many highlights from this year's virtual conference. So coming from One UI 3, what are some of the biggest improvements that we're now going to see in One UI 4? We are launching a new tool for them to create a fun emoji pair animation for them to create uh, their own content to express their emotions and then deliver to friends and family via messenger. You can check out this full episode by clicking the link in the description below and many other fascinating interviews with influential developers, designers, and tech insiders discussing all things related to developing for the Samsung ecosystem. Listen to POW, the Samsung Developer Podcast, wherever you listen to podcasts.